Hello and welcome back to Against the Storm. In our last episode, we continued progression through this uh, Cursed Royal Woodlands and uh, found a few uh, a few ghosts, I think four or something like that already. And we're just making more progress here as we go. Um, we have Sother the Ancient here, which has some stuff for sale that uh, I was kind of questioning what I should spend my money on. And I think I'm going to buy both the Apothecary um, and the in the lowered hostility because why the heck not uh both were suggested also in in the comments and chat but i think buying both of them makes some sense uh for the apothecary specifically uh it, it gets us that a uh, little bit better uh cosmetics recipe which makes the uh, harpies happy and it also gets us a incense recipe which would be good for the humans uh since we have the wine stuff for the uh, beavers as soon as we get the place to sell it i think it makes sense plus Buying a building here, this is this is the best reason I can think of to buy a building here in in the uh, in the in the trading the trading post. Uh, it takes it out of your random pool, so if you buy it here, then you don't have to deal with it uh, popping up and having to take a spot from a building you might otherwise want. So that's a good reason, and we have plenty of amber, so we might as well buy them both, right? Uh, we could sell these for the three three twenty five. I, I, I don't really care. I just, it just doesn't. Yeah, I don't really care. So I think we're just gonna let it let it slide right here and uh, we'll just take that stuff and, and run with it. Now I think I put people in here, but I didn't click this investigate button at the end of the last episode. Uh, we do get this cannibalism perk, which is kind of kind of funny here. We already have one, but we'll get it twice. So if anybody else leaves or dies, uh, we'll get now then 60 meat instead of just 30. Uh, which should be good. Uh, infused tools, pickled goods, and pigment from there. This is a regular chest. Uh, we should, if we get enough tools, we'll go ahead and take that. Although we're going to get six infused tools, so we could spend those on something. Let's clear so they're out of here. This is also a small one. This is a uh, ghost chest. We're getting some tools from that one as well, and some uh, crystallized dew I saw. Is this six? It is six. So we'll open one of these medium caches with those infused tools. Infused tools. Once we get there. Uh, let's see if we can adjust you yet. Yes, we can. And let's build a that. And do we, did I build everything but the apothecary? I don't know. We should probably build a um, blight post also, though. Because we might need it eventually. Pause for a moment. Uh, let's see. Mine we don't need in this biome. Uh, carpenter, provisioner, apothecary. Yep, we're, we should be good. Uh, bakery, cookhouse, cellar. We did build the cellar. Okay. What do we have here? We have sea marrow, bleeding tooth mushroom, flax, fertile soil, ghost of a mad alchemist, and the hidden trader cemetery. This one made me laugh the last time we had it, so I, I'm, 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 I'm smiling inside to this one too. Uh, so let's. First off, take a look at what the what the ghost has to, has to deal with us here. In 30 minutes, if we don't deal with it, uh, pain and suffering speak through the phantoms of the past. Destroys all stored sea marrow, oil, and coal. Well, we don't have that much of those, so this wouldn't be um, critical. But uh, have at least 14 blight rot cysts at one time. Well, we're already up to eight. Uh, we can easily handle almost twice that amount so we should be able to handle 14 if we can get it there i'm going to not activate the blight post but if we can get it there we'll do it i don't see why not uh, if we can't then we can just uh we'll just let him you know destroy the sea marrow oil and coal we have i guess uh we'll we'll use the uh crystallized dew here again and uh, we'll see what happens and then we'll of course get a chest if we win uh, you put you put CMR right here in front of my in front of my road, of course. And let's take a look at this. Uh, you can have you could have CMR, or you could have re let's give you resin. Uh, some secrets are better left untold. Getting forty hostility every sixty seconds while we're working the event. Uh, incense for root production, that's good. Some tablets and some pottery. Um, <laughs> uh, we're at. Just over, just under 11. Uh, this will be goods are worth 50% less to traders. That's not super bad, but. Um, do I want to take the reputation point here? How close are we on some of these? We have two to turn in right away. Uh, so let's just take the stuff here. I like stuff. As you all well know, I like stuff. So go ahead and work this, get it done. We'll get that, we'll get that additional hostility, but it'll be okay. And then we'll go ahead and turn in archaeology. 
which is tablets and glades. Boom. And then Master of Exploration, which is glades, tablets again, and dangerous glade events completed. And that's going to get us a steady supply of pottery. Which means that the building that I took, this one here, I don't think we're going to need the pottery anymore. We can leave it turned on, though, because it doesn't really hurt. Um, but I think I will just make this these two a higher priority than that. So they'll only try and make pottery if it's below 30. And they've already made as many biscuits and pie as we can have. I think that's fair. And we'll go ahead and make, uh, let's make some herb pie as well. Uh, artisan temple temple would satisfy everybody if we had a scroll recipe which i don't think we do uh artisan uh, now forager camp we could take for the vegetables that would be food it wouldn't be a bad deal we could pickle the pickle the vegetables uh the smithy uh, only would take that really for the two starved packs of trade goods let's double check i don't think we have a scroll recipe but i want to check uh, here, uh, consumables. Yeah, we don't. So we have a choice to make. Uh, first off, let's go in here. Burner Chris, one or twenty coal for every three burn blight rods. This. Well, we're not going to burn very many of these for, for a while yet, or any of these for a little while yet. So we get at least fourteen of them. Uh, leisure is ale. I don't think we have an ale recipe either, right? We don't. And Firekeeper's Armor, every burn sister, there was an additional 50 corruption. Um, I guess I'll take the free coal, but it's, I mean, I could, I could also re-roll them, I guess. What about people? Uh, let's see, we have four workers free. Yeah, we could take some more people. Five and five. Um, let's take this one. So, I could re-roll. I could take the temple. I think I should just take the temple and hope I get a scroll recipe. I think that's fair. I think so. I'm going to steal one of you. Come down here. Let's clear some more of the trees around here. Be back here at home again. Like this. And maybe just do all of those like that even. And then uh, the temple I'll put in there when, it's, when the time comes. Uh, cosmetics. Yeah, we don't have any oil yet, so we're not going to make any cosmetics yet. Uh, we could use eggs if and when we have them. Incense. I'll use resin for incense. We have a lot of it. We don't have a lot of it, but we have enough of it. And wood, I guess. Um, let's go ahead and have somebody start making some of that. And then biscuits you don't need to make here. So just incense, please. <coughs> Hostility is going up, thanks to this, of course. Uh, we have one stack of it now. Should I have them... We have five fuel somehow. I don't know how we have five fuel, but we have five fuel somehow. Uh, so I think I'm not even going to put anybody in here yet. Uh, because then I'll just have to deal with them. But I'll go ahead and set the limit on the recipe here. That'd be good. Uh, you're done there. Let's move you down here. Up here, though, we probably should trim those trees right there. And I'm guessing the farm building actually goes back there in the corner. Uh, so we'll have to get our road up going up there. I think I'll just go around this Seamar Alpha right now. Actually, we could just do like that. That would be fine. And then I guess we can put a storage in here. Uh... Except that I'm clicking on all the wrong buttons. Why don't we go... It's going to be one of those two corners. I just don't know which corner it is. I think it's this one up here. So why don't we kind of just go here, somewhat centered in the biome. Maybe we'll put a road this way if we decide to get those mushrooms, which we don't have. A herbalist. Uh, we can also get that. Harvester. Speaking of plant fiber there. Uh, I think that's the only plant fiber left. So we'll go ahead and have somebody come pick that up too. Actually, let's do it like this. And I will just go ahead and put this road in here. Why not? They're free, right? Uh, except that part. That's not free. Uh, so we also want to take a look at these new roads. Uh, these are the, what are they called again? Reinforced roads. They're made with copper. Uh, copper ore. And they give you a nice, nice speed increase. So I think it's actually worth potentially doing like this road here. Uh, because we're going to be... 
traveling along that road? Or no. Actually, this road here would be a good one to do. Unless I don't put a storage out there. Uh, yeah, let's do this like that. But let's also do this one here. Uh, from here down around to there someplace. And that'll give us a little bit more speed boost uh, for them to walk around in. Uh, this one actually would be a good one to do too. As I'm spending all my copper probably. We're going to wait. We're going to wait because I don't know. Don't know. Uh, you can move this way. Also, let's kick this game speed up a little bit. I, I set the wine at 30, and I was getting uh, yelled at about that. Let's kick, kick that up to 40. Because, um, well, we need 40 for this. And, uh, yeah. So, we'll make 10 more. It's fine. Uh, mushroom, uh, mushroom pickled goods, that's good. But yeah, we really could use that guild house. We could also use some more happiness, so... Uh, I'll, I'm going to get that tavern built, or temple rather built, just so that we can uh, have it built. Even though it's not really going to affect their happiness any. Uh, any other cooking food recipes we can do here? Pickled goods, biscuits. Why are we not making any biscuits? Are we eating all the biscuits, or what's going on with that? Let's put another person here making more biscuits. Although we could even, you know, turn on the biscuit recipes everywhere. That's actually not a bad idea to do. Um, is this still the best thing? Probably. Yeah. So we're competing with the pigment for the roads, but then again, they're doing a good job of laying them out, so that's good. Uh, I don't have that much copper left, though. Um, where did they put copper at again? Seven. Yeah, so I don't want to do this road yet. We'll wait. I need to sell a few more goods. Um, did I make packs of provisions? I did not, either. We could make a few, like six. Uh, not with herbs, but with berries. And I do want to put a plantation up here, so how about you? Yes, you. Come up here and get those trees cleared so that we can, uh, uh get a plantation in here so we can get some more berries planted. Berries and mushrooms, I don't, I don't care which one. And how are you doing? You're at nine. Yeah, we need to make some more stuff or something. Why don't I let you make biscuits too? Uh, wait. Wait. We're we not getting any roots anymore. Yeah, we are getting all these roots right here. Um. Might as well give you that recipe. You can help. It's all two stars, so who, kind of who cares? Oh, those, uh, those, those parts here. We only got five. We only got five. I thought it was six. Or are they not done unloading? Oh, they're done loading it. Oh, we have a field here too. Forgot about that. We have these eggs up here too. I think, I think it might be worth another scavenger. Since we didn't get the trapper. Might be worth another scavenger. Harper resolve is low. Yeah, that's because they've got crappy housing. Um, why did this fire go out? Bizarre. Uh, we need one more beaver house. Humans, I have 12. We need two more hu human houses, too. We get those built. The harpies are relegated to... Why does that fire keep going out? I don't understand. Oh, it's because there's not a storage close enough for them to get to the goods fast enough. Alright, fine. And I'll put a warehouse in here, too. Cranky pants. Get that one done faster. How many, uh... Ten. We're moving. Moving along. Oh, I need 35 packs of provisions. I forgot about that. Fine, then. Make packs of provisions out of berries. I guess. And we're gonna... Ooh, we almost lost a harpy. Ooh, we might still lose a harpy. Yeah, we did. We lost one harpy. It was so close. But I noticed it too late to even be able to help anyways. 
woodcutter needs to move. All right, you're done with those trees. Are you done, done? You're done, done. Come over here and get these trees too then. And then we also should have this guy come up here and pick up some of these eggs. They're meat eggs, so they will be good for... Um, uh, we can actually maybe make some jerky. Where's the jerky recipe at? Here, no. Here, yes. And yeah, that's fine. And only make uh, 20 of these though. Okay. Uh, don't need that. You go there. Let's do um, more farm fields here. And let's do plantation. That'll keep that fire burning because they'll be able to get to the storage to get their the wood because the wood doesn't take the wood doesn't burn for very long so that's why build please thank you and then we're not going to do plant fiber we'll just do berries and mushrooms stone cutter needs to move okay um stone cutter I'm of two minds on this. One, I don't want to pick up a bunch of sea marrow if it's just going to get blown up by that ghost. On the other hand, meh. We'll just pick it up anyway. We're just burning it anyways, so that'll be fine. Uh, you, come over here. We'll work from there. Uh, this is still going. We could put a storage out here. Maybe that's not a bad idea. I would like to see what I'm looking at for this field, though. I think it's right there, actually. No, it's not. It's back here, I think. Chop, chop. Yeah, it's right there. Okay. So, let's put a storage in here. Another another warehouse. Uh, that'll be fine. Chop these trees here, too. And then I'll also have workers come and do this. And Jorg is here. Harpies are happy. Humans are happy. This one we have. We picked that up from... We could take it again, but we have this one already. Uh... Boost to global food production speed. That's not a bad idea. And planting. Does this affect planting and harvesting too? I wonder. That wouldn't be a bad idea though. Uh, packs of provisions. We're kind of saving up for this. I could do some trade routes with some of them. But um, we could buy some, some food items if we wanted. Let's try it. Let's see if this actually affects... If not, I'll take this one potentially as well, but I think I'm going to take this one uh, just to see how that affects uh, growth at the at the farms as well as um, actual production of, you know, complex food. Uh, what about... Selling these? Meh. Take some other kinds of food, I suppose. I'm just going to go meh on that. Uh, you. You get... Okay, it does affect. That's good. Not that we couldn't take the, the, the planting one too, but I think that one's a better investment. Let's do this. Uh, where are we at? 11 now? Creeping on up there. Uh, anybody? Ooh, everybody's affected by this. No, 29 out of 44 are affected by this. Woodcutter needs to move. Alright. We should probably look at another glade. Those two are pretty close in there. Uh, that one's pretty close over there. Actually, those are all pretty close right there. We could punch through here if we wanted. Why don't we go over here to this side, where these are pretty close. Uh, we have that road already coming down this way. So we'll have to go around these mushrooms, but no big deal. Like that. 
And then let's just punch right through there. Now, I wanted to build that temple. I forgot all about it again. Let's put that in here. I'm going to take our cornerstone. Plus one harp resolve for every 70 cosmetics produced. We could do that. Fungal guide. We already have that, I think, one of those. Maybe that's right there. Uh, not that we couldn't take it again. And vineyard town, we have that also. Not that we couldn't take it again. We might even have this one. We've seen it before. That's for sure. Um, we haven't made any cosmetics yet. We don't have a place to sell cosmetics yet. We could make them, but I think this is probably best. Just take two of those. Uh, you can be moved a little bit now. We can plant a little bit more farm fields. And as soon as we get that cleared, we can put down the uh, farm. I, although I might need to remove another tree here. You know what? Let's just remove all those trees right there. That'll be fine. I'm going to not take another group because we have like eight or ten people who aren't assigned jobs right now. So unless they had something really compelling, which one tool or three amber are not really compelling. Well, we should look at these. No and no. Could. Is it worth it? 216 plus two plus 80. We could. Um, I am. You know what? I just missed it. I forgot about this, too. We need to sell 12 more amber worth of goods. Nope, nope, nope. Uh, this we don't have. We could just do this. That'll get us 12 amber. This will cost us 434 plus 160. I think we'll do that. I think that's fine. Here, yeah, we're making berry provisions. That's fine, too. We'll have plenty of berries coming in eventually. Eventually. You all can get back to work. We're almost there on this, although people just got sadder again for some reason. Um, we'll see how that holds out. We can at least start selling incense here to the, for the humans to get them a little happier. 14 humans. I have 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. Okay. And 12 enough for those. And then a bunch of crappy houses for the harpies. Uh, we only had five of those, right? Yeah, dang it. Uh, well, we can use this 38 tools we have, though. Let's go ahead and assign people to this. We have plenty of people. Let's go do it. And this one here, even. Yeah. And there's one over here. Is there any in here? No. Do this little one here, too. Because we had... Yeah, I think we had plenty. Yes. Let everybody else just do regular old work. Took all the stuff. Maybe I should have taken some of those points, but... Eh, double check. Double check. Maybe the points are better. Yeah, let's take the point here. And what about you? Or the half point, rather. Yeah, we'll, we'll spend those 16 on a point. That'll knock this down a bit. That'll be helpful. Uh, let's throw three people at this. I wish we had a scroll recipe. I wish we had a scroll recipe. There... But at least we get this um, burn effect a little bit longer here. You're done. I could let you trim these trees. Maybe I should just let you clear these out of the way. And let's build a um, plantation here, too. Last couple of farm fields right there. And we'll get a plantation up there for the next... Uh, next, uh, whatchamacallit, spell. We popped into this glade. It was a crappy glade, so I didn't even come over here. Plus, I didn't notice it. Mushrooms. Um, a few berries right there. None, neither of which we can harvest because we don't have an herbalist. A little farm and a little person here. They want to open another camp. Of course they do. Uh, we don't have any right now, so we'll have to wait and see. Uh, let's go ahead and do this and then that eventually. Um, you know what? Actually, let's do control just to take those out of there. We'll let you guys work on this. And uh, we'll come back to it. Harpies are happy again. They must just be getting food off and on. The jerky's helping. The skewers are helping. If we're making the jerky, should we make the skewers? Um, what's over here? Well, it's the roots that are the problem. The root of all evil. Actually, you can use either of those. Uh, let's do jerky here at priority. Maybe. 
trade route completed. Oh, I forgot to um, auto collect those. Do that, and then we can turn this in. Three more people and 12 more tools. All right, well, we got two points to spend now. Uh, we could do that to smell some of that copper, but meh. Um, I think we're still running on a yeah zero star fabric recipe. Nice. I think it was zero star bricks too, right? Nice. Uh, that would get us a scroll recipe. I think that's probably our best bet. Although my luck, I'll get the scribe in the next uh, the next batch. But we can always make coats. We can always make coats. Pick that. No, okay, good. Well, not good, but uh, we still need a guild house, though. Uh, market, we can let us sell the. Uh, yeah, let's 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 do the uh, market, because it's got luxury and cleanliness. Uh, Explorer's Lodge has duplicates we don't need. The Harpy House would be good for the harpies, not lion, and that wouldn't be bad either for the uh, for the fabric. But I think the market's our best bet here, so we'll take that. We'll put the market up over here in this town. It's a bit bigger. It's a four by four building, so I might need to clear some space here. Yep, I do. Yep, I do. Clear those out. You can come up here and do this. And um, what else do we take? Oh yeah, the clothier. Clothier. There you are. All right, we are crazy high impatience wise or uh hostility wise well impatience wise too let's pull at least one what is this gonna be running cysts i don't care fuel efficiency is lower that's not as good that's not as good we're at 11 cysts only um dropping another level is not gonna happen with woodcutters alone so I think we'll just let it happen. We have too many villagers again. That's our problem. I know. I know harpies are low. It'll be fine. I don't know that we're going to hit this just because we have a whole other year left. Basically to the beginning of the drizzle. To get three more cysts. We haven't burned a cyst yet. Uh, let's assign two humans in here. No plant fiber. You start plowing if you have time. You're done. All right. Then you can come over here and help with this job. So you can get it done. Harvester's camp. I don't think there's anything else left for you to do. Oh, yeah, there is. There's some over here. There you go. Go at it. Uh... We could... I think we'll just play with the lighter treatment here for the harpies. Because the beavers will get down to five. They'll go down to zero, but it'll be fine because we'll just toggle it back and forth a little bit like this. Make the harpies happy again. We'll get them all up to three, and then we'll toggle it back again when the beavers get too low. And then we'll be out of the storm before you know it anyway, so it doesn't matter. Oh, they're going to two. Okay, well then we'll do this again. And we'll be out of the storm before you know it. Out. Before you know it. There we go. Alright, another cornerstone. Fuel again. Um. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Um. I guess I wish I'd have taken that uh, harpy cosmetic one. You know what? Let's um let's re-roll here. Route delivery line. Well, that wouldn't hurt. Minus four to hostility for every hub upgraded to neighborhood. That's not a bad idea. That would give us minus eighty, and we could even put another one in. Generous gifts. Newcomers bring forty percent more goods with them for every hub level gained. Um the routes wouldn't be bad, but we're kind of nearing the end here. So I think I'll just go to a safe haven and we'll drop our hostility down by eighty. And we could, like I said, we could also put in another, um, oh, we, over here, uh, another, uh, small hearth. We have, um, how many people do we have? 47. So we could easily afford three times 14. I just have to move some houses around, which wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, we have a good, nice, big open area down here, maybe? Uh, over here would be good. 
Let's take a look before we unpause again. Let's take a look. Yeah, we could do out here. Um, out here would be a little bit tougher, so out here is good. Uh, we could do it right here, actually. Let's just do it right here. Build that, please. Uh, we have a storage close enough. So you don't have to worry about that particular woe. Um, you still want three more cysts. Yeah, that's going to be tough to accomplish. Uh, let's get this thing going. A harpy here. You can make coats and scrolls. Oh, wow. Uh, definitely use those first. And then use these next. And then, oops. Uh, those last. Pigment, yes, please. Not the wine. Uh, 30 is fine there. Coats, let's make a few extra coats. Like that. We're going to put two people in here. Um, I think scrolls should be a higher priority. No, it'll be fine. They can balance it. Let's do it. Uh, so the, we'll build this here. We'll do a... Reinforced road around it. Four, five, yeah, that'd be fine, like that. And then, um... How's this going? Plenty. And then, uh, wait, were we making the jerky yet again? Forget. Here? Another human can go in there. Doesn't work. Woodcutter needs to move. Yeah, let's put you all down here. To get a little more of those trees cut. I don't know about it opening another glade at this stage of the game. Uh, we can cut these ones too since I have them marked. Uh, then we'll put in a person here. Uh, I don't care who. And uh, we can do... Um, we can move some houses down here. We we'll want to move... Enough for 14 people. Um, we have... Well, it's just, we could move all the beavers out. We could, we could go full, like, um, I oh, know we had to move other than that. Let's move some of each. How about that? This costs some wood, but who cares? Uh, human houses. Let's move, like, and be careful to do this not, not wrongly, but, um, move, like, four human houses. And then, uh, that's enough, depending on how it works out, enough for uh, eight people. Uh, and then we could do a couple of beaver houses. There. Should have done it the other way. Stupid. There. And that still leaves 16 people here, which is good. And then let's also move... Um, we have 21 people here. Let's move a couple of these houses, too. Shelters. One there. And one here. And then we want to build uh, the stuff we need down here. Um, no, not there. Put it over here. Put it over here. And... Um... And then a couple of these... And a couple of those. And that'll get us all the way to neighborhood. Um, once they get all that stuff built. I'm gonna still ignore the parties. Because we have... Still have four people unassigned to jobs at this point. Um, at least ignore them at this moment. Whether I keep ignoring it or not is... Maybe. Uh, but... Ooh, we're out of that. We're out of that. Should go ahead and make biscuits with berries too. Biscuits with berries too. Pie with uh, berries too. Um, we didn't turn on this biscuit recipe, but we could. We could. It's obnoxious, but we could. If I do that, though, I'm going to want to make this in this higher priorities than that, just because of you know reasons. Uh, Flour. Wait, did we? Are we? Did I make all that flour from? Not the provisioner. Okay. Uh, that means that you need another worker here. Humans are thirty-two. Wow. Oh, we did put that market in. I forgot the market. Uh, that can go right in here, like that.
Yeah, I know. I just spent a bunch of stuff. How are you doing? You're making fabric? That's good. That's good. First delivery. Here we go. Uh, we need to draw in some more people into here. Uh, that might mean... Moving one more of these houses, or removing one of these houses. There. So you still have 15. You still have 16. And you should have 16. Once they're done building the things, we'll be good. Woodcutter needs to move. Alright. Uh, I was cutting trees down here. Do I still want to be doing that? Maybe. We could also potentially take care of these here. That's not a bad idea either. Your deal was you wanted... Oh, you wanted one of those. Right. That's what I was doing this for. Uh, let's do that then. And this... Where are we at with uh, cysts? 12. Two more to go. We have to get them this year or we're not going to get them. Though, it's gonna, that guy's going to blow up. Uh, and it's going to destroy 66 C Morrow. Uh, we could... It is, murder, it is burnable, so we're okay there from that perspective. Uh, let's see. Sother. Um... What do I want from you? Could lower our, our uh, hostility again. Take that, doesn't count. That's, that's kind of meh. Um, if you sold fancy tools, I would buy one. Let's buy this. Is there anything else I want to buy from you? I could buy some scrolls, I so we don't have to make so many of them. Um, I could also buy cosmetics. You don't, or you do have cosmetics. Am I making, did I turn the cosmetics making on? Where's that even at? Consumable games, cosmetics. No, I did not. I didn't build the cooperage. Oopsie. Um, turn that on. Wait, what was I going to make at the cooperage? Uh, you can make cosmetics with eggs. Set that limit to 30. Save that. What else is at the cooperage? I bet you can't, like, hover or click or whatever there. I never made the cooperage. Oh, training gear. Did I have... No. So training gear is actually not one that I have right now. It's kind of unfortunate. Um, that's okay. So, is there anything I want to sell you? These five, again, these five. I suppose I could buy some of these with it. Ooh, look at that. That'll work. Deal. Some scrolls. Is that'll supplement the scroll making wherever it is here? No. Here. Yes. We just started, so it's fine. How about those packs of provisions, y'all? Oh, deliver. Uh, turn that off. Well, no, leave it on, but turn it down. To six. I don't have anything to use those tools. I have a ridiculous amount of tools right now. And I have nothing that I can use them for. I've opened up all the caches. There's fewer caches in this because of all the ghosts, I think. Close that. Oh, we just won. Well, we got a Cursed Lands uh, deed. It makes sense. 63 food, four of each of those. Continue for just a moment. Yes, I know. I was hoping to see what's in this glade just to see what's in this glade. It's a small glade, and there's no um, there's no encampment, so that wouldn't have helped me. We could have potentially gotten into that one and found an encampment too. But, um, yeah, of course we just got this. But that gets us... What does that even get us? Oh, right, the ranch. Um, ghost of a Terrified Woodcutter. Oh, it's a beaver ghost, too. You can see the... Looks like a beaver. Uh, keep the hostility level at or below one for 120 seconds. That's actually tough to do this late in the game. Wow. Yeah. 
so we ended up with um, 14 cysts, though. So we could have taken this. I'm going to do it just to press the button. Five minutes left. See what was in the chest, mostly. Uh, just stuff. Just stuff. It's fine. All right, so I'm going to take a quick picture here. Um, before we go, I'll just take it of this area, I guess. Doesn't really matter that much. And then we can go out to the um, Citadel and see where we might want to uh, or take a look at our deed and maybe spend some upgrade points. Uh, let's see. Yep. So we get the uh, wall crossing from that. Uh, there's the wall, the gate for the wall. Is there like a wall wall piece? What's that? Anvil. Oh, nice. Umbrella. Pipe valve. So many of these things. There's the the wall wall piece. Curse of Royal Woodlands on Viceroy. Okay, we'll do that eventually. That won't be too tough to accomplish. Let's do this here. And um, what do we want to buy? We have 88 points, so we ought to afford two. Uh, 88 food, that is. And we can afford um, anything, as long as it's not two of the artifacts ones. We can afford any any of them. Uh, let's see. Plus one cornerstone or blueprint for sale. That's not a bad idea. Um, plus 10% citadel resources. That's good, too. Plus it, it, this one gets you moving faster through the tree here, so that's not a bad idea. Embarkation bonus for fuel stuff. Embarkation goods would be a good idea, too. So, we could also look at this one. Lizard house. Again, good ideas, good ideas. Embarkation point. Hmm. I want this one before we go to Viceroy. That's for sure. And maybe even one more of those. Before we go to Viceroy. Just because the Viceroy is going to take away one of them. So, I want to replace it. Um... Let's take this one <clears throat> and this one. All right, so this is a good spot to end for today. Otherwise, ooh, look at that. What's that? Levitating monument. The power of a nearby monument makes everything feel lighter. You can move most buildings in your settlement. Ooh, nice. So uh, uh, let me know in the chat, in the comments, or on Discord. Uh, where you'd like me to go to next? Uh, we could we could pick out one of these uh, modifiers: levitating monument, barren lands times two, uh, royal outpost, and pick any of the tiles next to them. Uh, the royal outpost, by the way, is uh, pool of order choices increased by one, and barren lands is no farming. So for barren lands, I'd want to do this near marshlands, which is good because that's where they're at. So we could do that. We could do royal woodlands here for this one, although it's going to cost us in. Uh, resources and food resources because we're not going to be able to take advantage of two of those tiles either way we do this uh the marshlands would be great because it'll be a lot of food resources as well as the machinery um here not as much they're even less so and then down here we could do royal woodlands and hit the royal outpost uh so let me know what you think or we could do another scarlet orchard or another uh, coral forest, if if you if you like. So, uh, yeah, let me know in the chat, in the comments, or on Discord, and uh, and we'll 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 head out there, uh, and in the next episode. So, thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.